Hi guys, what's going on? My name is Zach and I'd like to welcome you to the second episode of my Zombie Driver playthrough. Uh, I'd like to thank everybody who watched the first episode and we're not going to delay it any further. Let's get straight into it. I appreciate the help that you are giving us, knowing that the army's hands are tied. You are uh, I don't need to watch this, don't need to watch this. Uh, we get the limo in this mission. Right, we have to rescue three people. Um, I don't think we need any more upgrades, although, actually, let's get the armor, because this car's armor is a bit shit. Right, let's do it. Um, I still haven't managed to get my Xbox control fixed, so for the time being, I'm still going to be using my mouse and keyboard. But, let's not let that get in the way. Have we got the Nitro? No, we don't. Let's go. So this mission we have to kill the zombies and I'm pretty sure that it said we have to grab the limo as well. So yeah, let's get down to it. Um, I, I hope you guys enjoyed the first video. It's not a game that I've seen many people play so I figured it would be, it wouldn't be a bad idea to make a playthrough of it, let get the game out there a bit more, maybe some people will buy it and yeah just basically give the game a bit more publicity because in my opinion it's a great game. Uh, it's, there's, there's no major flaws, it runs very well in pretty much every aspect that it needs to, there's no lag or anything like that. What's this? Just kill all the zombies in the zone. Ah, uh, right, yeah, I remember. Right then. Uh, we need to find another minigun, because this has no ammo, so... Uh, let's see, where can we find one? Minigun, 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 minigun. There we go. Uh, come on. There we go. Right, come on then, you don't have it. How many have we got? 80 left, 70 left. 60 left, uh, 50 left, still don't understand how, well obviously it's just a game but I don't understand where there's people still in the city, I would be gone, no way I'd be staying around to let anything get on like that, I'd le at least get out of the city into a more rural area where there's not going to be any dangers like there would be in the city. Let's pick these guys really up. really come to save us? The soldiers that came in the helicopter didn't try to rescue us. They were searching for something in the school basement, but we only heard their screams and they didn't come out. Uh, yeah, this is the first sign in the story where things are a bit awkward when they're... It, it's starting to show that the zombie infection might not be an accident, so to speak. Yeah, the limousine is pretty worthless though, because it's well, it's all right. It's just a bit shit. It doesn't handle all that well. Obviously, it's very long, so it's not good in tight zones. It's not that fast. The armor's very good, but apart from that, it's borderline useless to be perfectly honest. So yeah, nothing really else. Well, no use for no use for it, but it's a bonus objective, so we might as well get it done just for the sake of it. Let's get grab this armor while we're here. Uh, I'll grab that minigun as well. Oh, a little bit of lag there. Grab this minigun, burst out. Let's go back and finish these more. Off. I really need to get some more upgrades for the minigun. I think, in, in my opinion, it's a bit underpowered. It doesn't have that much damage factor to it. It's got a, uh, it's got a lot of, rate, it's, it's got a high rate of fire and quite a good bit of ammo. But other than that, it hasn't really worked. So I have actually used, well not used, but um, I've gone into the files before and changed all the settings to give it more ammo. But Disables uh, what's the, it disables leaderboards, so I reset it. And obviously, when I started the playthrough, I reset everything, so it didn't really matter anyway. 
So yeah, let's get these left back down to the army base. Hopefully within a reasonable time. Oh, shit, train. I don't understand why they have moved the trains out of here. They're not helping me at all. Oh, come on. Uh, where's the entrance? There it is. Drop these lot off here. Oh, wrong button. Still haven't really gotten used to the controls, but that's alright. Alright, that's the first mission done. Oh, Anna. Achievement. I think that's to save 100 people. Yep, we got the limo. Oh yeah, these retards going around trying to record record everything that's going on because that's really going to help people. Um, again, I don't use the flamethrower, so it's pretty pointless buying that upgrade. Yeah. So, again, uh, make sure that you guys leave a comment and uh, let me know what you think of my commentary style and anything that you'd like me to talk about. Um, I might start doing face cam soon, I'm not I'm too sure yet, but I might do that if, if that's something you guys would like. And yeah, uh, these guys, what do they have to say when it wants to Thank start God talking? You're here. We need just a bit more time to get this piece of junk moving. Help us fend off the zombies for a little longer. Like you offending them off at all, you're just sitting there trying to start the engine. Oh shit, loads of zombies in the air. Right, come on then. Come on, go, 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 go. Burn them, burn them. Burn them all! Right, we need to find some help. Finish off the rest of this minigun and then we need to find another one. There we go. Right, come on then you lot. Take some more of this. How many more? 57. Oh, they're just there uh, replenishing. More of them are coming back. Alright, got that many left. Got that many left. Yeah, the, the, the minigun's got a good range and everything, but it's just not got the damage at the early levels. You have to have the high upgrades for it to do anything, obviously. The missiles aren't good long run because, well, you only get about eight of them and it's only good for a massive pack. It doesn't really help you if you're trying to kill those men. Yeah, let's grab that. Right, pick off the last couple. There we go. Two more. Oh, these dogs are going to come. Uh, there we go. Thank you so much. We are heading off to the military base. Meet you there. Cool. Don't understand why you're here in the first place, but cool. Good story. Cool story, bro. Let's get out to the military base. Nope, wrong way. Oh god, don't do this. Right, let's get back there. We'll boost through that. Murderous combo, butcher combo. Those points. Oh yeah, and another thing, guys. Um, if you guys have any requests for games to play, uh, don't hesitate to let me know. I'll definitely work on getting any games that you feel would be, would be good for you to watch. I'll be happy to do them. And yeah, what's this? Well there we go. Got some more upgrades and some more money. Yes, we should level two. Right, so wow well, that's expensive. Um that's just rescue only six, so we're gonna have to use the limo. So we should probably get some more speed and ramming. Don't need any more armor or survive for the moment. Uh yeah, you know we'll just get on with it. Fat zombies that explode everywhere, pretty cliche in a zombie game. Uh no, we don't have any guns yet. Give me those machine guns. Give me that. And let's go. So what is it? Three each place? Yeah. And the bonus objective I'm guessing is another kill order. Yeah, the story in this game gets pretty uh, pretty sketchy at some points. Because obviously 
you're just you're not a military person, so to speak. You're just a random guy who turns up in a taxi and they send you off to rescue a couple of people and you end up running all these errands and shit for them, so it, it gets a bit Oh, boost through that, don't need to get in there. Uh, it gets a bit sketchy at points, but as I said, it's it's a great game overall. There's no flaws in the game or anything. You've always got a good a good mission to play and the cars and everything are all good. The uh, upgrades aren't too expensive. I know quite a few games where the upgrades are just impossible to get because money is so hard to come by. Wow. No, this is what we call Where are they getting killed from? I'm confused. Let me get this machine gun. Where are they dying from? Come on, die, 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 die. These bloody layers are so impossible to kill at low level. Oh, there we go. I'm still a bit confused about where these zombies are getting shot from. Die. Where are they getting shot from? This is a bit weird. Are they getting shot from inside this building? Oh, they are. That's all. Stop and pick these up. Oh, are you serious? There we go. Why didn't these asshole army guys come to save us? What am I paying my taxes for? Why would you need to go to the industrial section? There's nothing there but factories. Using you, man. Ah, uh, got one of those cliche Hispanics with the, the moustache and the accent. Working at a construction place. Hilarious. Uh -huh. right, let's get to this next place and pick up these next three people. Oh, nice combo. Get a little slide on this turn here. Whee! Go, go, go. We're here. A little shortcut. I think, if, I've heard about uh, you can get mods for this that uh, allow you to go down into first person, but it's just not one of those games that is a first person because the zombies are on such a large scale that it just wouldn't make sense driving first person because you just get overwhelmed so easily. It really wouldn't make, oh god. Bussing the make out of the way. Uh, yeah, it wouldn't make sense to be a first person because you need to, the, the whole point of being where's up is that you can see like your surroundings, so you can see when zombies are coming behind you and in front of you and so on. It doesn't help you if you can't see where they're coming from. There's a minigun around here. Slide and kill these last ones. The last two. There's two there. There we go. Got these other two. No, stop it. There we go. Thanks, man. They almost got you the door. We would have been the supper in a few minutes. Ah, uh, and you've got your cliche American from. Uh, where is that? I feel to say Boston. I'm pretty sure it's Boston. Yeah. Uh, let's go and do this bonus objective quickly. Bash this out. Oh god, my car's fucking flipping. Never seen that before. That's a new one. Come on, boost through this. Oh god, it's one of these. Come on, get through it, get through it. Give me the bloody move. Take it. Oh, back, back up, back up, back up. Ah, oh, god. boost against that guy. Throw this high because it's gonna keep on spawning them. Are you serious? Run out of ammo. Oh no 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 Come on, explode, there we go. Fuck yourself. There we go. Side mission finished, get a little bit of extra cash. Oh, let's head back to the army base and finish this mission. Come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Wanna get back in a normal time. 
pretty sure all the missions in this game have a timing factor, so the quicker the better you get back, the higher score you get. These uh, these fat zombies get to be a bit of a problem at this point in the game because your cars don't have that much armor, and when you're boosting down the street to get places faster, if you run into one of them, it just takes off so much of your health that it's, it's, it's stupid. Mr. Turn. Yeah, we did. Let's get in here. Drop these lot off. These people don't, don't seem to understand the meaning of get out of the city. How much money do we have? Nearing 50 grand. And we're going to get that bonus when we finish the mission. What do we have? Yeah, an extra there. So we're at 65 now. Uh, so I think I'm going to leave it at there, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a like and a comment. And as I said, definitely let me know if there's any other games that you feel you'd like to watch and I will work on getting them and posting content for them. Uh, so my name has been Zach, thank you very much for watching and I will see you on the next one.